All right, listen, if if you've been working on trying to get your ex-girlfriend back for over a year now and you're not really making much progress, then, you know, there's a very strong likelihood that your ex doesn't want to get back <laughs> with you. All right, if it's been a constant on again, off again, she seems like she's feeling me now, we just might get back into a relationship, and next thing you know, She's talking to someone else and she's no longer as interested. She's not responding to your texts and your phone calls like she used to. And then she's back responding again and it's just back and forth. And it's been over a year. She's totally showing you that she's not interested in you in that level. Now there might be something still there. You know, she might she might feel a sense of maybe just maybe, you know, I, I just I don't quite want to get rid of him completely and shut him out of my life but I don't exactly love him, you know? And that could be the attitude she has right now. In fact, there's a very strong likelihood it is because it's been over a year. So what you need to do is just end this, okay? It's been over a year and you essentially, you have no idea how many opportunities that you've lost in the last year trying to get back with your ex-girlfriend when you could have met someone else who could have been even better for you. So what you need to do is end it now, all right? And if she truly wants to get back together, she's going to be the one who steps up and, and makes the effort. And since you've been the one initiating most of the effort the last year, if she, if she suddenly notices, oh my God, he's not making the effort anymore, and she panics, and she suddenly starts communicating with you and, taking the, and putting out the effort, boom, you just might have her. But that's not going to happen if you keep trying the way you've been trying. 